dog, but not warm enough to heat the home in the winter in Canada. No, you actually need natural gas to do that in most places. And the tax on that gas is going to be going up by almost a full quarter, 23%, which will mean hundreds of dollars more in costs for families like Kathy. Now remember, he told us that he would give you all the money back and more. That it would be, you know, it's like that. It was like that uncle who sends you an email from a faraway country claiming that you don't know who he is, but he, oh, he, he's going to pass away soon and he wants to bequeath you a million dollars. You just need to give him your credit card and password and he'll deposit into your account, right? One of these scams. That's the Trudeau tax scam. So I brought some bills here today to, 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 to shed light on the Trudeau scam. Because here are the facts about the Trudeau tax. Here are the, here are the facts, acts the tax. Here, let me look at the data for Ontario. Trudeau's plan is to more than quadruple the carbon tax, up to 61 cents a litre, and at a proportional hike on your home heating and on everything shipped to you. According to the Parliamentary Budget Officer, when this tax and the second carbon tax combine to take full effect, as they will over the next five years, should God forbid he be re-elected, re the total cost to an average family in Ontario will be $4,078 in carbon taxes.